wow, you guys really have some really good customs here. I really like how they look like. Anyways, let's get on to the next person. And what the fuck? Alright everyone, so for our first custom submission for today's video, um, is actually a Wither Chica figure. And this is not a Funko Custom, by the way. Well, most of these are Funko Customs. And honestly, it's so accurate to how it looks like in the game. I don't really have any problems with it at all. Uh, the only thing I'd do is give it like a black wash or something to make it look a little bit dirtier. But other than that, it's really good. I'd probably give it like a, a 9.5 out of 10. Okay, so for our next one that this person has submitted, it's the same person, by the way. They have a Withered Foxy custom, which I think looks super good. Uh, again, I have, like, no problems with it. I think this one is a lot better than the Withered Chica one, honestly. And I'd probably give it a 10 out of 10. Okay, so for another one... Anyways, we have a Mullen Freddy figure in what looks to be a Shadow Shadow Toy Freddy figure. And actually, I think they look pretty nice. I like how you did it, but I would have used a Funtime Freddy. No, do not use Funtime Freddy for any customs. Uh, unless you have, like, multiples of them. But, um, I would have used, like, Glamrock Freddy's head, because it's the exact same mold as, uh, Funtime Freddy. And just, like, redid it a little bit to make Mullen Freddy, but then that's pretty alright. Um, it's nothing too special, though, so I'll give him, like, a, somewhere, like, a 4 out of 10. And for the Shadow Toy Freddy figure, I will think I'll give him, like, a 4.5 out of 10. Now, this is a different person. They've, they've been in all three of my custom rating videos, I'm pretty sure. And they submitted four new customs. For their first one is a Phantom Freddy, which I think looks super accurate. I really like how that one looks. I think it looks really good. I'd probably give it like a, somewhere around the 7 out of 10. Then they have a, another custom figure from the game, which is uh, like the stuffed Freddy that you get in the game over screen. And I think it looks super cool. I really like how it looks like. I'd probably give this like an 8 or like 9 out of 10. Yeah, I'd give it like an 8 out of 10. Then they have a Mimic, which they were actually in my last video. And they actually put in this one. So that's pretty cool. Um, they, as you can see, they've upgraded it since the last time. Which I think makes it look a lot better. But uh, I'd probably give it like about 7 out of 10. Or whatever. Uh, and then uh, he has another uh, custom, which is a Fredbear figure. And I think it looks really cool. Um, it is made out using Glamrock for you, which I don't really think is the best idea. But it's alright. I'd probably give it like a 6 out of 10. Okay, so someone else submitted customs, and one of them is a Glamrock Tika custom, well, Shattered Glamrock Tika, and I think it looks really good and accurate. Um, I don't really have any problems with it, although the face could be better, that's one of my problems with it. But other than that, it looks pretty good. Um, I definitely think it's really good, I'd probably give it like a 7.5 out of 10. Now, a figure that looks really cool is the Blob. They made a blob figure, which I think looks super good, and I really like how it looks like. This is like the first time that I've seen someone do a blob figure for these submission videos. Anyways, I think it looks super well, and I honestly think it's super accurate to the game. Although, I don't know why he doesn't have teeth and stuff, but other than that, he's pretty good. I give him like a 9 out, or actually, I give him like an 8.5. Now, someone else submitted a custom figure, and as you can see, um... Just kidding, no, you can't see what this figure is at all. Uh, it's it's supposed to be a movie Golden Freddy figure, which is what the title says. And, honestly, I gotta be real, it does not look like Golden Freddy at all. Especially the movie one. It looks more of like a Freddy Fazbear that has, like, his ear chugging off. But, yeah. Also, I don't know why he used System Era Toy Bonnie's arms or Samrock Freddy to make this guy. But overall, he's just, like, super bumpy everywhere with the paint and stuff. And I'd give him, like, four out of ten. Now they have a uh, like a toy mangle figure, which I think looks super cool as well, and it, I really like how it looks like. And I honestly will give it like a about five point five out of ten, just because this one's a little bit easier to make than the other two. He also made to to toy and oh god, what am I saying? He also made the toy animatronics, uh, well at least uh, toy Freddy and toy Tika and uh, fixed mangle, and they look super cool. Uh, they actually look like the toy animatronics from the game. I really like how they look like. And they honestly just look good overall. I'll give these two about a 6 out of 10. Actually, yeah, 6 out of 10. Okay, so for the next custom figure, we have a mango figure made by someone. And, oh my god, this mango figure looks so good. Like, actually, this is a super, This is the best mango figure I think I've ever seen. Like, for a custom acting figure, this looks so cool. I really like how it looks. 
and everything just looks super accurate i mean i really don't have like any problems with this figure it looks really good it's like probably the most like, yeah this is like the most accurate mingle figure i've ever seen it's a great job this is like a 10 out of 10. someone else made a good custom figure yep uh negative out they also have a withered fox um, wither foxy no i'm oh, sorry they also have a nightmare foxy figure which i think looks super cool as well although i don't think it's as good as the withered bonnie uh, what am i saying nightmare bonnie figure but it still looks really cool um i'll give this one like a five out of ten. someone else made this black light uh spring trap figure and i just want to say this figure is so cool looking i really like how they made this figure um and honestly this looks super cool it looks like a fun like a f actual toy company made this custom like actually this like the paint is like spot on on this figure like every little detail is like painted in like perfectly and there's not like areas of paint going on to other areas honestly this looks super cool i'll give this like a 7 out of 10. oh god um Ooh, no no um do i need to say anything do i need to say anything I don't think I do. I don't think I need to say anything. Okay, so someone else who's been in every single one of my custom figure rating videos has made a burn trap custom snap, and this looks super cool, actually. I really like how this looks like. Um, definitely looks really good. I really like how they made this burn trap snap. Although it looks pretty simple, it honestly looks like burn trap. and looks like a Funko were to make burn trap. It honestly looks like that. I think they did a really good job making this figure, and they this looks really cool. Um, I'll give it like a six out of 10. Anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And please like and subscribe as I can make more videos like this. And be sure to share the video with anyone who thinks that they'll f find it interesting. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video whenever I'll be. And comment down if I should make another uh, part four or well, another one of these videos. Actually, and this, this video gets to like 15,000 views or something like that, or even 10,000, I'll make a part four. Anyways, thank you all for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.